hi guys, so I am back. I, I am going to get comfortable and we're getting ready to start twisting. So we're gonna go ahead and get my hair ready for that. Just putting some olive oil mixture on my hair <clears throat> and we're going to comb it out. It's already been detangled, washed and detangled, and stretched. But I didn't want to put any heat in my hair or anything, so. Comb this side up. Okay. Okay, we're going to use the Curl Enhancing Smoothie as our moisturizer. Okay, guys, well, I'm sorry. My um, battery went dead. It was just a mess. So I have started twisting my hair already. We're just doing, they're not small twists, just a little larger than a small twist. But this is what we're doing. And that's because when I go too small, my twists get tangled up. So I do like to put them at a pretty decent size. So I didn't want chunky because I'm going to be wearing these. But so this is my size. And then I'm just, as you can tell, just making parts and doing it that way. So, okay. So that's our first row. I mean, that's our. So that's um, where we've gotten so far. It's about four rows. I'm going to clip those back down to keep them out of the way. So you guys know how to twist, so we're just going to kind of flip through this anyway as opposed to having you watch me do this because there's nothing dynamic about how I twist my hair. Um, This is my Curl Enhancing Smoothie, and that's what I'm using as my um, cream. I have a leave-in, I have an oil, and then this is what I'm using for my cream. And then when I get to the, and I try to twist pretty tight so that they stay. And when I get to the very end, then I will put some Eco Styler Gel just on my tips so that they do not unravel. So that's what we're doing. And I do part my section so that it is neater but I don't um, part between each twist so I'll show you guys that with this next section and then we'll start skipping again okay and that's a 
a little bit of my gel. Can't even really tell. It's just a little dab. And I just put that on my tip. And that's the twist. And then I clamp those down. Oop. We'll switch it over this way this time. And then we'll start on the next section. And as you can tell, I have my hair sectioned off. I kind of, you know, start in the back and just work my way up. But my hair still was in the four sections. All I did was just put it all together and I'll just go straight across. Okay. My son just came home for the weekend. He's in college, so he just came home. Well, I won't say for the weekend. I think he said he'll go back to my work. So, you know, once they go off to school, they develop their own little social life, so. So I'm putting my olive oil mixture on here. And you can blow dry your hair if you want to, you know, to get it really straight prior to twisting, but I don't really find it necessary for me because once I do this comb through here, it's usually straight enough for my twist. And then I go back and I comb each section as I go, so let me show you. So I just pick me a section like this, and then I just pin the rest of this down. Grab a small tooth comb, rat tail comb, whatever you call it. I grew up calling it a rat tail comb. So then I comb through to get that, make sure it's nice and smooth. And then I go in with my cream. And I'm not trying to saturate my hair, I'm just trying to make sure that it's coated. And then I start twisting. And just the main thing when you are doing your twist, as I've said before, Make sure you're not borrowing hair, you know, taken from this section because you get low or your hair gets thinned out at the end. Don't do that because it's going to make your hair tangle. You're going to have knots. <clears throat> it's just best not to do that. So make sure when you divide your hair into your two sections that it's pretty even so that you can stay with the sections that you have made. So these two sections will go all the way to the end. As you can tell, I try to make sure they are pretty tightly twisted. That helps it to last. So now when you get to the end, I just twist it around, put a little bit of gel on the end. And that keeps it secure. <laughs> okay.
Yeah, yeah. 